This is Industrial Action, and I am bringing to you today another Sabre. Uh, this is a Nocturne Armory uh, Sokotano. So this is something that I actually uh, have had in my collection for a long time and just finished up the install. Um, kind of, I guess I did half the install and then put it aside for some reason, and I found it the other day and decided to finish it up. So uh, you can see in here that this is really accurate version of uh, the Ahsoka Sabre. It is super light, so um, you know, perfect for somebody who's small like she was, and uh, really richly detailed. I mean, it's got the pins in here. Uh, this is the blade retention screw. This is just uh, a little greebly. Uh, I've got here the uh, the ring that's on this side, and then the cover tech over here. Uh, in this box, which you can see came scratched, um, I've got. A tactile switch underneath here and another one underneath here, so main and aux. So it's a, you know, sort of a modified touch plate activation. Um, an old kill key that I like to do. And uh, we'll go ahead and pull the kill key. I'm the new Padawan learner. I'm a Soka Tano. Being a Padawan is harder than I thought. So that's a boot that I just made. And uh, let me turn off the lights. Alright, so, uh, let's see. Essence, episode one. There's Essence, episode one. This is my first font. So we've got the green main, and then, let's see. Red blaster blocks. Orange lockup. You seem less hospitable than our last meeting. We've got the uh, FX quotes in there. So I got a bunch of those loaded. Got of course dual phase. It's a nice long dual phase sound. Go back out of dual phase. Back in the green. Essence Episode 2. This is Essence Episode 2. This is another one of my fonts. So now I've got uh, the Old Republic style Viridian. Dual phase into a purple. Now this is Pod Racer. Pod Racer, another one of my fonts. Yellow main. Flip over into a blue. That was close, Master. And you can see when I'm showing you all these different um, options here, these are just things that we can do um, with Igniter. I mean, if I wanted to, I could just leave every font green. I mean, I'm just playing with the colors to show you the options. This is Rain Sizzle by Nova Star. Got the purple into the green. Back into the purple. Lock up, different blade effects. Skip that one. Rain sizzle. This is uh, the new rain sizzle or the newer rain sizzle. I wanted to try this out. Just got this from Saber Font. With my lock up mode. Kind of the cutting the door type of thing.
All right, let me get the lights. So uh, yeah, I mean you get the general idea, like I said, um, with Igniter we have lots of different options. We can do um, you know, four different colors per font bank, so 36 different colors uh, per saber, plus of course we've got the blade shade, class shade, blast shade, things like that to add even more variation in. I don't need to run through all those, I mean basically, you know, there's this term running around this whole rainbow saber thing. Um, you know, there's no need to make your saber have every color in the rainbow, I mean if you want to you can, and that's what I show off in all my demos. Um, but you can certainly run every font green and make it completely accurate. Do some uh, fun things with the clashes and the blasters. You know, use dual phase, don't use dual phase. I mean, all those options are there for you. So, again, this is uh, my Sokotano by Nocturne Armory with Igniter R4. Hope you guys enjoyed it.